Hi, my name is Isal Vera Montes. I'm a 285-pound former uh, Division One football player. I'm here uh, to attempt to break the strike plate lock. My background is in the martial arts. I'm a certified Krav Maga instructor in military and civilian, former jiu-jitsu coach and also judo coach and a wrestling coach. So let's see what we can do today. This is a door chain purchased from a big box hardware store. Okay, here we have two store-bought door chains from a local hardware store, big box hardware store. Two at the same time. Let's see what happens. Okay, one's a little tighter than the other. Oh, okay, that was two door chains. <laughs> here we have a standard metal sheath door from a big box hardware store. $40 deadbolt and door set. Deadbolt, two inch screws going into the 2x4 holding the plate, which we recommend to secure your door even if you don't have the strike plate lock. That's being kicked on. It's gone. Gone. It's almost there. Okay, split the door, didn't stop the screws, it's held solid, but the door itself cracked. I don't want you to do it, but you do it. <laughs> okay. Alright, you ready? Okay, here we go with a strike plate lock on the door. It comes with standard 2 inch screws into the 2x4 that frame the door. Generally you have two 2x4s two that frame the door. We use the third one because we're not hooked up to a house. Okay, here we go, kicking on a strike plate lock. You stop for one second? Yeah. Okay, we're still kicking on that. Well, he's not kicking now, but as you can see, there's nothing holding the door. 15 kicks. 15 kicks? Yeah. Okay, straight plate lock so far has survived 15 kicks from a 285 pound football player. Martial arts instructor. Here, take a rest. <laughs> we'll, uh, <laughs> the door opens. Give him a chance to rest. This would give you time to call 911 and say, hey, somebody's kicking on my front door. You can go a few more. 23 kicks. 23? Uh -huh. Nope, go yeah. on. <laughs> don't, don't do it. Okay, you're okay. 285 pound man, played football, martial arts instructor. He bent the door, but he did not get past the strike plate lock. Two inch screws go into the framing of the door. What can you say? Okay, here after, how many kicks? 39. 39 kicks. The door is bent, giving him a little more access, but he still can't get the ring off. And that's with the ring at full length. With a levered door handle, you literally have to close the door to get the ring off. My arm's preventing me from opening it. Okay, go ahead, take it out. Now, what you can do is you can also take the chain, twist it twice, and then open it. Try to stick your hand in now. Now it even has less ability to reach inside. You, 
Now try, try, give it a couple of kicks with the twisted chain. All right. You're still filming? Mm -hmm. Go. See, that's with the chain twisted, shortening the chain, making it even harder to fit your hand in there. Like I said, with a lever door knob, you have to close the door to take the chain off. Okay. okay. In about 39 kicks, I stopped. With all sincerity, I thought I could, I, I could blast through the door, and I was ready to give up after probably the 30th kick. So, uh, as a uh, teacher, researcher of Krav Maga, I endorse this lock. Strike uh, plate locks are one of the things that I will promote on my website.